पिछले कुछ समय से भारत में इतने सारे एक्सेसरी प्लेयर्स आ चुके हैं जो कि डी डब्ल्यू एस लॉन्च कर रहे हैं स्पीड सब लॉन्च कर रहे हैं वॉच लॉन्च कर रहे हैं और एक और प्लेयर है जो मार्केट में आया नाम है रोमेट टेक्नोलॉजी और ये जो कंपनी है ये इंडिया हेडक्वार्टर कंपनी नहीं है मतलब की इंडिया में है लेकिन इनकी शुरुआत हुई थी तालिबान से और आज हमने सोचा चले इसी कंपनी के इंडिया हेड से बात करते हैं और जानने की कोशिश करते हैं कि भारतीयों के लिए उनके पास क्या है उनके पिटारे में और इसीलिए हमने इन्वाइट किया है गोपाल जयराज को जो हेड है प्रोमी टेक्नोलॉजी के इंडिया में वेलकम टू द शो गोपाल थैंक यू सो मच थैंक यू सो मच गोपाल सबसे पहला क्वेश्चन दिमाग में ये यार आप एक ऐसे सेगमेंट में घुस रहे हैं एक्सेसरीज का जहाँ पर ऑपरेटिंग around accessories mobile and it accessories so in 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 all these perspective i definitely think uh, promate have the entire experience to operate in india and uh, we don't feel that uh, we, we are late so we we all always feel that uh, we are we are on time now so india is booming and india needs promate kind of brands to enter and uh, provide all their good products to the consumers of india so we will come with a a good good note and i think we will make a big success out of it as well right so kopar uh, okay uh, yes we are in the market at the right time so you but i think it's time uh, indians who oh, are kya to offer kare because if i look at the international side there too many products that's been over there with have not been lost in india correct uh, so in that perspective uh, i am identifying the right categories because we want to enter india in pace by pace launch uh promate biggest advantage uh, it, it is its uh, categories and uh, the skus under each category so as of now we have 20 plus categories and uh, 1270 plus running skus as on date globally so uh, ideally it's not viable for us also to launch everything together in india so that's why we have made the launches uh, pace wise and uh, initially the categories which we are focusing on is uh, chargers which is the key category of uh, promate and uh, then we want to enter with uh, it peripherals which is keyboard mouse and various other audio video connectors plus uh, we will be launching immediately our backpack series and these when it goes as a, a, a launch from any uh, category or vertical we also would be launching our smart watches in a massive way so we have a great lineup of products uh, coming into india and smart watch is globally our uh, a new launch uh, for us and uh, we are just entering category in in the month of january this year so i think in india also will make a, a good benchmark uh, though it is it is dominated by certain few brands but we want to be in certain segment where it is uh, least operated by all these uh, big brands which is currently dominating the market right so gopal aisa lag raha hai ki aapki jo timing thodi sahi hote ja rahi hai kyunki offline what you see in the market that all sare smartphones jo launch ho rahe hain charger ki dabbe mein aa hi nahi raha so is this the reason for focusing too much on the charger side now or see charge boards uh, before covid and after covid is what we should take actually it somehow uh, we all felt uh, charges also is not only wall charger it 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 comprises of power banks it comprises of wireless charges it comprises of cables and uh, power banks uh, we were told that it was it was getting stagnated or, or the requirement is going down uh, but post covid uh, it it changed actually post covid even though the smartphones are coming out with uh, larger battery capac- capacities power bank is something it's not to uh, only to recharge the phone power bank is something when your phone is at 0% or 1% and you need something to charge while you are on the move so you even though if your phone phone is having a 10000 mah battery inside also there will be a time where that 10000 mah will go to 1% so and there will be a time where in that 1% you will be on the move traveling without an option to charge your phone so power bank is uh, will become a mandate accessory for a customer to carry uh, going forward because our contents are huge every our screen time has gone up uh, people using uh, the smartphones so in that way i see a, a, a huge jump uh, it will happen in power bank requirements because uh, the moving uh, technology is towards uh, power delivery 
and lot of uh, Qualcomm uh, QC quick charging requirement. So our power banks are moving towards those technology adaptation into it. Plus, when it comes to chargers, you might have lately seen the smartphones are uh, announcing by launching that uh, uh, our smartphones are 140 watt uh, charging speed, 240 watt charging speed. So when they say that, uh, you cannot charge that with a regular wall charger. You you should need a 100 watt charger, a 140 watt or even a 200 watt charger. So ideally these uh, primary devices, whether it's a smartphone or a laptop, which will push this accessory sales as a larger attachment to it. And we want to be uh, a fast uh, or, or quick to market uh, in, the, in those categories as well. So that's why we have chosen uh, our new GAN technology product chargers to be launched in India. And uh, we will be ensuring that uh, going forward, uh, we will be the first to enter India market as well in many categories before any other brands venture into it. But tell me one thing, uh, you also mentioned about that a lot of categories in which will be the India first. What could be this category? Okay. Uh, see, it's, it's, and it's not only about category, it's about consolidation of product that we believe in. Uh, and uh, personally, I have seen uh, people who hate uh, carrying too many products with them. Like, uh, we want to make it more convenient for a consumer who travels a lot. And these products are attached. So, when they carry a smartphone, they they are pushed to carry certain uh, accessories along with the smartphone when they are on the move. So, in that way, we feel consolidation is the best thing uh, for a consumer to believe and the move towards when they uh, go for a purchase of any particular product. And that consolidation is what we are doing. So we are combining two, three products into one and we want to give it to the consumer. So we are starting with our uh, key category, which is the chargers. So we are combining a wall charger and power bank and a wireless charger, everything together into one. And we want to provide it. Tell me one thing, like, I know also that our uh, plan to exit is smart. Mm -hmm. We're smart now, what is doing also. And too many places in the market were launching the smart portal. So, what makes your what different from is only different. Okay, I will quickly give you an example uh, attached to it. Initially, when TWS launched, so TWS launched in certain mid premium segment as a new category when it launched. But when the evolution happened, everyone started launching TWS, and now the TWS category is uh, uh, even sub 1000 rupees but that's right now the consumers since tws is for so many years consumers are moving towards understanding the technology they need in a tws and they are wisely uh, started making uh, 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 intelligent decisions to buy what product they need so they, uh, simply speaking they are not now going beyond only the pricing like behind what technology is used in the category as well so similarly, I feel smartwatches also, when it launched, it launched in a segment premium. But slowly when the volume uh, eruption happened, everyone uh, started giving a product only without any te technology attached to it. Or they don't uh, bother too much about uh, what is what should go inside the product. So they were, it's, it's all going behind a pricing strategy. So even smartwatches, you can start seeing going some thousand rupees or sub thousand five hundred rupees. But I, some, we as a brand, uh, ProMate, somehow feel that it's not required. Uh, consumers should be given a good product and they are willing to pay or invest uh, the price when they get a good product. So that is more as a ProMate as a brand. Uh, since we have our core strength in charging, which is mainly battery related products. And uh, since we are the technology driven company, uh, in our smartwatches, we have adapted the grade one chipset uh, in all our smartwatches and the grade one sensors in all our smartwatches. And uh, when it comes to sensor, whether it's a pedometer or any heart rate sensor, we use the number one uh, chipsets available and the sensors available. And this means it's also integrated with a solution that we are using in a smartwatch, right? Every brand will use a solution. But uh, rather than naming the other brands, the other brands, we know what they are doing. It, the solution is not owned by them. So they just go to a factory, they source a product, they just name it and uh, they are importing it and they are selling it. But we, Promate, I can confidently say we own the solution and we know the solution. So which means the hardware is by us, the solution is also by us and we are rightly integrating it. And we confidently say our activity tracking or health monitoring is is uh, much more advanced than the current smartwatches that are selling in India. 
and uh, soon we are working on some projects where we want to even establish ourselves saying that we can become uh, a smartwatch which is almost equivalent to a medical device so so in that way we are making it uh, much more advanced and we are not in this uh, price war game so Gopal, right now what is it not affected by running of your product is it in india or you are importing it from taiwan uh, see uh, the entire operation started in taiwan uh, but when the migration from taiwan uh, moved towards uh, shenzhen uh, as a manufacturing so we moved all our r and d uh, to shenzhen though our designing majorly happens in california and the uh, uh, major uh, the manufacturing is in uh, shenzhen only and we have the two hubs uh, one to operate the east or uh, asian markets the other one to operate middle east and european markets so we uh, make uh, manufacture in shenzhen and we move stocks major or majority of the stocks to our dubai uh, pre trade zone warehouses uh, make in india is is something which is evolving very fast and here it's not uh, we can call it as make in india it's it's purely assembling in india actually speaking so uh, uh, what what is happening to be put it very bluntly is uh, people are importing components uh, which is like uh, a split of the fully finished product and it is getting assembled in india and it is getting uh, packed and then it is it is going into the consumer so we feel that uh, we want to enter in india where we want to make the entire product from the scratch itself like uh, a drawing a designing sourcing of components and a proper manufacturing in india so we will be doing it because our products every each product uh, follow certain in uh, quality standard and uh, we definitely want to ensure that the same uh, quality standard is followed uh, with the infrastructure provided by indian manufacturing companies and we want to ensure that the same internationally which is getting delivered to be delivered for our indian consumers as well so that is where we also as a brand we can feel satisfied that yes we are doing justification for make in india so we are waiting for that opportunity we have already started discussions uh, probably in next few months uh, we will be opening up uh, three or four categories uh, to enter into india market with make in india attached to it so far the doctor who ran and i'm interested in like about uh, what promote is that it do and you are very straight in direct uh, about this uh, the manufacturing in india so looking forward to see your more products in the market in the mountains friends uh, but aapke dil mein kitna hai gopal ke saath agar aapko aisa lagta hai ki mera sawal ko me straight nahi kuch hai to tabhi tak us din ho to jawab denge aur secondly agar aapne kisi ne promote products kiye hain to wo bhi comment section mein bataiye ki indians kaisa raha hai aur bhi sabhi apna काम को